Just lapses on defense, uh, like Coach Walsh emphasized. Me and um, Sam did a great job for NC State with the post, but we weren't we were unable to come up big for our team with the post, and they just got easy shots. Um, and it was just basically the post players. We weren't really playing how we normally play and um, capitalizing on some of the, some of the things that they do. So. Um, I know I take ownership for what I did, and I'm pretty sure Sam does too. So we just have to come back and for Virginia Tech come stronger. Aisha, what went through your mind when Asia went down? <laughs> I think what went through everyone's mind. <laughs> Please get up. Um, <laughs> we need you. <laughs> Please. Um, Asia's a fighter, so to be honest, I knew she was going to get right back up. I think it was a cramp. I don't know what was wrong with her. She said, I think she twisted her ankle. Ankle. Um, but Asia's a fighter, so I knew she was going to get right back up and give us a boost that we needed. Oh, that's okay. When, uh, when Lamont went out there and heroically picked her up and carried her off, the, how nice of oh. a moment was that? I was about to pick her up too, but I was like, I don't. I think that's wrong. Like, I'm. We might have gotten a tech or something. <laughs> but I wanted to show my muscles off too, because I wasn't doing what I needed to do on the course. I was like, you know what? Let me show the crowd I got muscles. I probably would have gave her a piggyback ride or something. <laughs> <laughs> what Sam, what made Derecki so tough? Hmm. Derecki. Oh, oh. Um, we're not stopping. Uh, we're going to continue to do what we're doing better. Uh, it feels good, but there's no time to relax. we got to know that there's a target on our back, so we're going to keep going. Um, I, I feel like, um, for me, <clears throat> I felt like everyone on their team had the opportunity to score. So it wasn't just having to shut down like one player or two players. It was like their whole team. And when one of us, like, was, was the word like, uh, I don't know what didn't the word is. Part. Yeah, when one of them, like, didn't, their do, didn't do their part, then we would get scored on. And it'd be like different people each time. So yeah, we weren't playing team defense yeah. what we normally do. We weren't helping each other out fast enough, or we weren't staying in front of our man, which caused another one of our teammates to come over and help, and then that person would kick it to another one. So I mean, team defense, we weren't we weren't there. Jason Jeff said that you guys aren't shying away from your start, seven in a row, etc. What allows mm -hmm. you guys to stay focused while you're still paying attention? Um. Our end, our end goal. That's what we're all playing for right now. We want to play for a national championship, and 17 and 0 does sound good. I mean, not a lot of teams <laughs> are still undefeated, so just the fact that we're able to compete and play at a high level every uh, every night is amazing. But our end goal is what what's what's um, pushing us. Yeah. You know, to keep going. For the what team? <clears throat> Oh, for the next game. Uh, defense. I yeah. feel like our defense, we didn't play good defense. Lacking. Yeah. You know, offense, it, it was going to come for some people, not me, it didn't come. But offensively, we were scoring. It's our defense. Well, I should, I should, I was talking about the lack of communication is one of, one of the reasons. And I, I guess the question is, why is it some hard for you all sometimes to communicate on the court, as he says. Tired. Uh-huh. <laughs> I'm joking. Yes. <laughs> like I'm trying to, to breathe. Trying to catch breath. <laughs> no, it's just something we're trying to work on as a team because we know um, when we play like Notre Dame, UConn, those teams are going to communicate when they're tired and mm -hmm. we're going to have breakdowns, but if we're able to communicate and keep fighting, we're going to be able to stick with them and, and play our game. Uh, 
He suggested that you possibly text each other to figure out who's guarding who. Do you think that could possibly work? We might need to move to FaceTime, but like, <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> no, I don't think it's going to work. I think we got to use our, our mouth. But we will. We will. Next game, you guys are going to see a lot better defense because this this wasn't good. And I take full ownership because my defense was horrible. Why do you say that? Because, like, we know we know scouting report defense <coughs> and we weren't playing it. Like, and I'm letting girls shoot shots that on the scouting report, they were there. So, I mean, I... I got to stay focused and stay dialed in and know this is what that girl does. She's not going to get it off. So next game, I'm going to definitely challenge myself to get back to how I was the um, NC State game because Coach Wall said that that was my best game in a while So on, de on the defensive end. So, I mean, I'm just going to you know, dial it back in and stay focused and play that 40 minutes. Even if I'm on the bench, stay focused, know what that girl's doing, know what she's hitting, how she's getting her shots, how she's getting her teammate open too. So... Um, I'm definitely going to stay more focused. Jeff mentioned a couple games back that he thought you guys were almost, you know, focusing too much on, on opponents at times and not enough on yourselves. How do you find that balance? It seems like now you're talking about tonight you didn't focus enough on the scouting report. Yeah. Um, yeah, that was hard. This is a really hard question. Uh -uh. That's a great question, Danielle. Um, dumb it down a little bit. Yeah, dumb it down a little bit. How do we find the, the how do we find the median? between focusing on ourselves. See, we're trying to be a great basketball team, so we got to find it, and we have to find it soon. There it is. There it is. That's it. Still, still to come? Yeah. I mean, we showed that we can like, we can do both. Yeah, we just sparks. have to, yeah, we just consistency um, that we're capable of, you know, focusing on ourselves, but knowing our scouting report. But we know our scouting report. Sam, two free throws at the end of the game. Oh. Two free no, throws. Yeah. Yeah. No, I was, <clears throat> I was nervous. Yeah, I was really nervous. Um, cause I mean, coming from last year, my free throws were not hot at all. But um, yeah, I try to get the ball up really fast to AC, so I wouldn't have to go through the pressure. But, you know, I held it down. Yeah, came in yeah. clutch. Clutch gene, clutch gene. Did everybody have to make the big play, though? Do you think maybe to be a good team? What do you mean everyone has to make oh, the big I mean, play? Oh, I mean, she had the free throws, you had a rebound. All stuff happens in the last That's, year. yeah. Um, I think that's just how we play, though. Um, I'm, I look at myself as a rebounder. I think my teammates look at me as a rebounder, too. So mm -hmm, yeah. that, rebound, <laughs> that rebound was nothing out of the ordinary. It was me doing my job in order for us to win. And Sam, she said she was trying to get the ball up, but I knew she wanted to keep it because she wanted eyes on her because I knew, we all knew, that she was going to knock down those two free throws because it's gotten better. Her free throw shooting has gotten better. So I think we were all like, whew, Sam got the ball. She's going to put these two in. <laughs> and if she's not in line, she's going to get that good rebound. Did you see the rebound off the missed free throw from Sam? <laughs> <laughs> so no we knew clap. she was going to do I know, it's okay. It's clap for yourself. Thank you. <laughs> you have four games on the road. Uh, how did you all grow over that period of time? And how did you like coming back home from the crowd? Yeah. Oh, the crowd was amazing. <gasps> it was it was awesome. I Yeah, that that felt good. Mm -hmm. Felt good. <laughs> Two more. Sorry. We're good. We had another tough, te tough test this weekend. What do you think? Any thoughts on Virginia Tech yet? Um, so, just we haven't watched them yet, but yeah. just from last year, aggressive team. They the point guard's super fast. fast. Yeah, we're gonna have to be able yeah. to stay with her. Their post player um, is really good too. So it's gonna be a good it's gonna be a good matchup. And if we come and play our game, then we should take care of business.